Have you always lived here in Rome? No. Okay. Can you tell me a little bit about how your family or you ended up here in Rome? How we made it here to Rome? I married a guy that lived here in Rome for 30 years his whole life. So okay. that's what moved us to Rome. All right. So <clears throat> um, that's really interesting. Um, so <laughs> we're... I am from a very, very small town in Alabama to this day. It does not have a traffic lot, so Rome, Georgia is a um, big city to me. Um, and right now, I actually currently live in a ranch-style brick home um, that I rent. Would you mind telling me a little bit about what type of home that you live in? Um, I live in, I guess I would say, a brick home, two-story brick home. Um, would it be It's in the neighborhood in Rome? Okay. So I'm not on the farm or anything. Okay. And you are a homeowner, correct? I am a homeowner. Okay. All right. Um, Do you currently have rooftop solar for your home? I do not. Okay. Um, Would you mind telling me why you do not have rooftop solar? Uh, Or was was that a decision that you made or was that something that was made for you? Never been discussed in our family at all. The home was built in the 50s and we actually bought it from my in-laws who owned it in the 80s. Um, up until we purchased it in 2011. So, I mean, seven, excuse me. So there's, we've never talked about solar energy. Okay. All right. Well, if you had the option to put rooftop solar on your home, uh, would you mind sharing with me why you would or why you would not? There would be a lot of questions I would have before we ever did something like that. Of course, the initial startup cost of getting rooftop solar energy. Um, and then I would need to see the benefits, the long-term benefits of why someone thinks it's a good idea. So I guess I really can't answer yes or no yet until I knew more about it. Okay. All right. Um, now I'd kind of like to talk a little bit, um, about rooftop solar adoption in general. So here we have a map of the United States. And then here's a pen for you as well. Um, And on this map, where do you think people have the most rooftop solar energy on their homes? And would you mind drawing that on the map for me? Do I just circle it? Whatever you would like. Rooftop energy. I'm just going to stay there. Okay. All right. So what do you think makes these communities or these states so different from the people here in Rome? I think it was weather related. Okay. Because I do believe they see the sun a lot more in California's area than we, well, I mean, we see the sun a lot, but. We've had a lot of rain. <laughs> we, we have in the past month. Um, I think they're also more progressive maybe and trying not, I mean, I do think solar energy is kind of a progressive energy movement and I feel over there in the West, they've done that a little more than we have. Okay. All right. Well, now we're going to talk a little bit about Georgia. Um, so in what community in Georgia do you think people have the most rooftop solar on their homes? Maybe around the Atlanta area. Okay. What do you think? Oh, you can, if you're oh, no. more, you can go ahead. And it has to be rooftop. It can't just be solar energy panels, correct? Um, let's see. Probably it is specifically so. asking Roof, for okay, rooftop. So I'm going to say the Atlanta area. Okay. All right. So what do you think, um, makes people from the Atlanta area, so different from people here in Rome? I think Atlanta has more of a population that's diverse from other areas um, outside of even the United States. So again, I'm going to go with there, have a more progressive probably outlook and maybe their income too could serve them better because I I would feel like the startup would be expensive. I may be wrong, but in my mind, I feel like it would be an expensive startup to put rooftop energy. So if you have that income, maybe. Okay. And earlier you were kind of talking a little bit about um, just solar energy in general. Is there a certain area that you feel in Georgia would have more of just like, I guess... I've just seen solar farms all throughout Georgia, and I actually have a brother-in-law that has a solar farm on his um, property as well in Burke County, So, um, and I know there's some in Polk County that we pass here. It may be Floyd County, actually, That's, but again, it's just panels, Mm -hmm. and I guess it's um, for energy somewhere maybe to offset power to a power company. I really don't know why they're there, but that was why. Okay. All right. Um, What about most of your close friends here in Georgia? Do they have solar on their roof? No. Okay. Why do you think that they don't? I don't know if this is the right way to say it, but I don't know if the trend has hit here yet. Um, But again, if it was marketed correctly and the income was there, 
and people saw the benefits of it, I could see it happening. But for friends I do know that have built recently, no, that is not a part of their plan. Okay. All right. Well, is there anything else that you would like to add? I don't think so. Okay.